Kev Mann, any thoughts on Howard Dean coming out against President Obama's diplomatic thaw with Iran? Uh, okay, so Howard Dean, I this enrages I was not even me. aware of this. This enrages Is me. Is he so a I'll, lobbyist for like the MEK or something? He's a lobbyist Ugh. for a group called the MEK, Ugh, and the MEK is Obama. this cult organization that was part of the original Iranian Revolution. There's a lot How of do history. Do these things? They split from uh, the government. Obviously, they're based politically in Europe. They had a camp in Iraq. They actually fought on behalf of Saddam Hussein against Iran in the 1980s. They've committed numerous acts of human rights abuses, including on many of their own members. They're a hybrid of like a cult and a guerrilla organization. And they have plenty of people lobbying for them, including Howard Dean. And that's where his Lanny Iran Davis? stuff comes from. What? Is Lanny Davis one of those guys, too? I actually think this is the one thing I that just... Lanny Davis might have missed. But pl- I mean, uh, Howard Dean, I think Victoria Clark. I mean, any kind of like mid-level to upper-level DC person you could think of who's just sort of like floating around has probably been paid that, I, I, to get them to t- take so, off of the terrorism list. They've been on a terrorism yeah, list. So, it's so depressing to me. Uh, Howard Dean, the best you could say about him on stuff like Iran is he has no idea what he's talking about. and you know, it's But it's appalling and pathetic. That's my thought on it. it and it, yes, he lobbies for MEK. That's... That, uh, uh. But it's just like, you know, like at what point do you go like, oh, do I really got to go out? Like at the very least, you know, when you get paid for these things, take the money on a weekly basis. So that's <laughs> like, you know, it's not like I, I'm going to give you we're going to give you uh, whatever the money is as a retainer. So that six months into your contract, you'd be like, oh, wait a second. I got to come out against this thing to stop uh, a war with Iran because I took 70 grand, 200 grand, whatever, uh, 500 grand. I mean, I don't know how much they pay uh, Howard Dean. I don't even know if he's still currently on contract. I mean, he could just be, you know, free freelancing from it. But, I mean, the stuff he did say when he was on contract was astonishing. And, you know, this is the type of group that it's like the when they tried to co-opt the Green Movement, the Green Movement people were like, oh, p- please, could you stay out of this and uh, not ruin what we're trying to do? I mean, it is a universally despised group. That's really too bad. <laughs> 